Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new Disney vlog! Blue! It's the first day of Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so the events have actually come up on the app now. Uh, we've got times for Let's Sing, so I think we're going to try and see the first one which is at 11.40, fingers mm -hmm. crossed. Um, but there's no time for the parades yet. No, so we just need to keep checking. It's a mystery. Yeah, I've got my Christmas bow in. <laughs> ah, looks really nice. <laughs> but yeah, let's go and see what else they've got. Disney Village Radio plays the Christmas hits. <laughs> Made a slight error, even though we printed off an itinerary with the opening times on. We thought that extra magic time was from 8.30. It's we from just, 8. <laughs> we got into that habit of just being like, oh yeah, half 8, and extra magic. <laughs> but it's it 8. It wouldn't be a trip if we weren't late. Yeah. Extra magic time. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'll still be all right because I don't think the characters are out for extra magic time anyway. I might be wrong. We shall find out. So you got the main queue, that's people waiting to go in when it when the park opens. Can't speak. <laughs> and then we're heading around the side. I think it's on both sides. I'm not sure. We're going around the right hand side. So as we enter, they've still got this section cordoned off. I think they're doing some restoration work to this bit. We can see that the Happy Holidays is twinkling. Do you want to quickly go around that side? Yeah. There we go. We've seen it in stages, but today it's fully twinkling. Oh, Lordy, oh I can gosh. see snowmen. Oh, I think someone's greeting us here. People have got their cameras out. Oh. It's Mickey and Minnie in their holiday gear. Here's the snowman, the Christmas trees, and then just look at it all. I can cry, it's so beautiful. <laughs> the goof, he's got all the presents. I'm not sure you should let him have all them. And there's the tree. Decision has been made to join the lion for Christmas Winnie. It's just too cute. Christmas Stitch might have to go. I know. <laughs> I just can't resist. It's too, too cute. Let's do it. I love little bits of trivia. And I was just looking here at the storybook store and it said 1891. So the building housing storybook store was built in 1891, as shown on the facade. This is the year that Walt Disney's grandfather, Keppel Elias Disney, passed away. I love all the little hidden features. So we waited an hour <laughs> and we got our photo with Christmas Winnie. We did. He this was happened, so cute. This happened last time with Winnie. <laughs> like, oh, it'll be long, but it won't be that long. <laughs> and then it's always so much longer than oh, we think. But there's like some lovely interactions yeah. with the uh, other people in the line. It was so lovely to see, but we're just going to uh, hang around a little bit around this front bit and check out some more of the decorations. Oh, Daisy and Donald. Donald's got a gift. Mickey and Minnie. We'll have to come back to the Christmas tree as it started raining. I think we're going to head to the bakery. Don't know who that was. <laughs> Where'd you come from? I didn't know you were here today. <laughs> right, snacks. They're all glittery. 
Oh, they mentioned. I'm so excited to see this. At mentioned night. the magic word. <laughs> what happens when I say it? Snacks. Snacks. <laughs> <laughs> We put a little kindness in everything we bake. Ooh, these look scrum diddly 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 umptious. Diddly umptious. Is that carrot cake? Not sure. Got some muffins. Some sandwiches. So, got myself the cheese and kiri quiche. And then Helena's uh, just getting something as well. I've just found a table here in the arcade. But yeah, I'm excited to try this. So Kiri is a spreadable cream cheese. So it's cheese and cream cheese, which makes it very cheesy. <laughs> it's nice though. Helena was lucky and found a table. Yeah, so I went to the counter where the quiche was. So there's sweet and savory now. Yeah, so the as you go in on the left is savory, on the right is sweet. Yeah. Which is good to know because if you queue on the wrong one, you can't get. Either one. Mm. But we got it. And there is snow on Main Street. So hopefully we can catch that. Just come into the shop next door to the bakery. Got loads of uh, glass items and also some models. They've got pop final figures. Oh, it's a Halloween cronk. <laughs> I do love all these statues, but I mean, once you started. Oh, these Christmas ones are nice. Yeah, two seconds. Oh, that's like a nice day till Christmas. We change the blocks. Ah, the Ewoks. <laughs> the train. I would like to show you these champagne glasses because I feel like other people will love them as well. Beauty and the Beast with the little rose going up. Oh yeah, they are nice. And they also do wine glasses. Oh, yeah. I thought they were really lovely. 29.50 for the Champagne flutes. For both of them. Oh, for both. I just think they're really, really pretty. We'll pop back later on, see if the snow's falling. <laughs> but we've got, I was saying, we'll pop back, see if the snow's falling a little bit later. Yeah. But we. It's falling right now. <laughs> yeah. We have about an hour till we want to go and see if we can get a space for Let's Sing Christmas at Cafe Hyperion. Gonna go do some rides. I think pirates is number one. Mm. Right here we go, pirates. I love one of the bits of trivia from the episode we watched, uh, the behind the scenes of the attraction. I can't remember the story fully, but it was something about um, how they got water from each of the attractions, and they did this ceremony in uh, Shanghai. No. Yeah, Shanghai, isn't it? I think it's Shanghai. It's a bit the, yeah, more intense, like... Like the techie. quite different one. Yeah. But, like, to make sure they were all connected, they got water from each of the attractions. <laughs> Mixed it. <laughs> Captain Jack. We might have to go there next time. I think next time, Captain Jack. Shaver me, Plaza Garden. <laughs> I miss them. He's a pirate. He is a pirate. He's a pirate. He's a pirate. He is a pirate. <laughs>
<laughs> Held her on the way here in the car because we had all these tunes on and then you'd picked a song from Pirates of the Caribbean and it was called He is a Pirate, which is like that amazing instrumental. But then for the whole song, I had Helena just singing, He is a pirate. They're the official <laughs> lyrics. It says so on the title. <laughs> We're going to see if we can go inside the Christmas store. What's that? Christmas tea towel? Tea towel with little pom-poms. Cute. <laughs> Do you like this from? That's a contender. That uh, is 15. 15? Yeah. Do you like the Mickey Nut? Do you like the Mickey Nut? I like the Stitch, Lilo and Stitch Orbitron. Patron. Yes. Oh, maybe, no, maybe we should get that because of the funny Orbitron <laughs> moment. Oh. Spider Man, we've got this one. Spider Man. Uh, Captain Marvel. Thor. Thor. All of them. Baby Mini. Baby Mickey. This is a strong contender because that's mine. That's the one. That's what happened. In Orbitron. <laughs> Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, red. And then it's that Phantom Manor. Yeah, I haven't seen them. Or Haunted Mansion. One of the two. They light up. Ah. Boom. <laughs> Living Magic are the ones that do something. And then Sketchbook are just like the nice ones. That's quite cool. With the uh, mm. red. I didn't realise Tinkerbell's at the top of the castle as well. It's really nice, that one. That might remind me of Disney Dreams, actually, because of uh, yeah. Peter Pan. Just want this one to be safe coming home. We just have to make sure... They wrap it up quite yeah. tightly, don't they? It's more about when we get it home. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we are heading over half an hour before Let's Sing, so we'll see how busy it is. Yeah, see if we can get in. It's the first show ever yes, this season. Yes, of this season. We still don't know about the parade and we're getting worried. I know. <laughs> Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. We're in a line. It's quite long at the moment, so hopefully we can get in. <laughs> um, so a little bit of time has passed. I can get like half an hour, nearly 45 minutes. We're in this really long line. There are three cast members at the front, but then there was no cast members like staggered across the line mm -hmm. to sort of like stop it or cap it. Yeah. So it meant just more and more people joined the line. So then it just got to the point where we couldn't go in. <laughs> so we were about 15 people from going in and um, the guy just said, it's full. You have to come back. But the next show's not till 10 past two, so ages. And um, obviously a lot of very unhappy people, understandably, because they had queued for about 40, 45 minutes at this point. It's just tricky um, trying to figure out how to actually... Well, they need to count it and then they need to stop the queue. Like, they do it for Lion King and they do it for other things, so yeah, but, I it's mean, a bit that's, disappointing I, I, they didn't do it It looks it like they're not going to do that, so it's like, how do we now... I don't know, I feel like you have it. to be in that bit. So I'll show you kind of what happened. So this is the pen outside and all of this was full and then that got let in first. So I think if you're in the pen, you're fine. <laughs> if you're in this area. But then the queue started through Discovery Land all the way back to Main Street. It was so long. Um, and obviously they let in a few people from the queue. We were just outside You're Cafe right, Hyperion. <laughs> so even then we weren't allowed in. So you have to be either in this pen of people or maybe up until about here. The other thing is, is it, it's a Saturday. It's a weekend as well. So yeah. it's, uh, it's probably even more busier. Yeah. But, um, we don't mind enough about not 
getting in. It was more just, <laughs> it would have been nice to have known 40 minutes earlier. Yeah. <laughs> so the only other option we thought is that if you buy food, you can obviously watch it from the top of Cafe Hyperion. If you get a table there. If you get a table. Oh, well, the, once you're in there, though, you can just stand up. So, I don't know. It's a bit tricky at the moment, but anyway, we're not seeing that one. So, we'll <laughs> come up with another idea. Um, I don't know whether that one's particularly busier because it's the only morning slot, and then the rest are 10 past 2, 10 past 3, 10 past 4. Santa over the Tannoy, got a gift for us all. It's snowing! the bottom of the tree, different presents, model plane, Russian dolls, train, teddy bear. <laughs> We have times now for the parade. We asked some cast members, we asked multiple cast members to make sure <laughs> that it was... Just double check it was right. Definitely. So what was it, 5.20? 5.20 and 10 past 7. Yeah, so they'll so, both be in the dark. Yeah, well, 5, yeah, because 20 past 5 is quite dark anyway, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? Isn't that normally dark by then? I'm not sure. I've lost all track of time. Yeah. <laughs> but what we think we're going to do now is we were gonna have our break after Pim Kitchen, but because we wanna try and maybe see Let's Sing Christmas and the parade, straight after Pim Kitchen at 2.45, the only time that we have for a break is now. Yes. We're gonna head back for maybe like an hour and a half, just to chill, so that we can last all the way till 10. Yeah. Oh, so some of the stalls are now open. Crips, waffles, there's another one further up. into Starbucks and on our way out they've got these great mugs but I think once you start buying one you're gonna buy the whole set aren't you? They got this Avengers really campus one. I don't know how much they are. Back at the hotel time to have a nice reset. Uh, we met a lovely family as we were uh, leaving the parks uh, they were here for uh, celebrating a birthday and yeah, it was just really nice to chat to you. You're staying at the Marvel Hotel. Staying at the Marvel, Jess. Which, yeah, yeah, we really want to stay there. Um, but yeah, we're going to just kick back for a little bit and then head out. I'm excited about Pim Kitchen. I'm excited. We still managed to get a lot done today. We yeah. met Winnie the Pooh, Christmas Winnie. Saw all the decorations. Yeah. Saw the snow. Went on Pirates. Yeah. No, it was a really nice morning. Yeah. Um, but this was just the best time to have a little break. Mm-hmm. See, we'll head back and then hopefully we can try, we'll see if we can get into Let's Sing Christmas and then hopefully we can catch the parade. The parade. I'm very excited for the parade. <laughs> oh my gosh, we nearly forgot you. Had to rush back. Could you imagine? Can't leave you in the room. You've got to come and spend the evening with us. Although you'd have a good time watching Disney Junior. <laughs> we <I> were. Do. <laughs> um, so we've just finished up our little break and we're heading to Pim Kitchen. This has been a dream for a very long time. <laughs> um, I can't believe we've done Waltz and Pim Kitchen. Um, quite a few people have messaged me on Instagram just saying, how did you get reservations for Waltz? We just booked really far in advance and that's the only way that we've ever been able to do it. We booked about five, six months in advance. Just looking at it as and well. And the same for Pim Kitchen. Um, 
I think, yeah, you either have to book in advance or you have to be very lucky um, on the day or like the day before. Um, yeah, they are hard restaurants to get reservations for. That's why it's taken us so long. You just keep checking. I can see my bow. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's why it's taken us so long to eat there. So we're very excited. See the food going through the process. Just above the kitchen area. So we're sat down, we've got the menu here. So for drinks, these ones are all included in the price of the buffet, which suits us. And then we haven't even got a colouring. I know, we don't have any colouring pencils though. Uh, Maybe you have to ask yeah. them. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're gonna go up for some food. Some bits to start us off. We've got like these mini hamburgers, and then they've got a giant hamburger that they're cutting up into bits for people, and like a giant hot dog that they'll cut up as well. Loads of different stuff. I've got a mini hot dog, look how cute it is. <laughs> I've never had a corn dog. Let's see what that's like. Just had a pretzel delivered. Warm, it's really nice. <laughs> Here's the giant hot dog. They just cut up a bit for me. So I asked for a small slice of the burger and this is what I got. <laughs> Martin said maybe you have to ask for the opposite. <laughs> I don't think that is a thing. <laughs> I think uh, this is just small. Whereas like he showed me the big slice and it was huge. It was like half the burger. It looks so good though. Cheesecake, and this is a maxi cake. So we've just finished up in Kim Kitchen, and I loved it. It's such a good experience. The tea service we had was so lovely. The food was really fun, and it actually tasted really nice as well. And we managed to actually eat quite a bit of it. Um, we didn't really eat breakfast, so we were very hungry. So we actually managed to try quite a lot of it. And yeah, I'd highly recommend. It is quite hard to get a reservation for, but if you do manage to get it, you're in for a treat. It's really, really good. So the plan is that we're gonna head over, try and get into Let's Sing, Let's Sing Christmas. Well, not sure. We're gonna leave this <laughs> vlog on a bit of a cliffhanger, so you'll have to watch the next one to see what we actually managed to uh, get in. Uh, but we're gonna run over now, try our luck and see. Um, but thanks so much for watching this one, and we will see you in the next one. If you like this one, hit the like button and also subscribe. Bye! Toodle Pipsky!